today's tip is going to be on the grip. The grip plays a huge influence in the golf swing and is one of the most important parts of the swing. We want to have our hands in a position on the handle of the golf club where they can square the club face through impact without making a lot of manipulations. To find your neutral grip position, what we're going to do is bend from your hips and get into a good golf posture, letting the arms hang relaxed from your shoulders. Notice how your arms hang turned slightly in. This is the position the left arm is going to seek in the downswing. From here, place the top hand on the handle of the club in the same manner it's hanging relaxed from the shoulder. The hand should approach the handle from on top rather than underneath. Place the handle in the fingers and let the thick part of the palm rest on top of the handle. Looking down, you should be able to see two to three knuckles on the top hand, and the line formed by your thumb and index finger should point to your dominant shoulder. When the top hand is in this position, we can square the club face without any manipulation. If I have just my top hand in this position, the club face is square to address, and when I swing back and through, the club face returns to impact in a square position. If I turn my top hand to the right, the club face is square to address, but when I swing back and through to impact, the club face becomes closed or pointed to the left. If I have my top hand turned too much to the left, the club face is square to address, but when I return to impact, the club face is open or pointed to the right. Next, we match the bottom hand to the top hand by covering the thumb of the top hand with the palm of the bottom hand. We place the first three fingers of the bottom hand on the handle and place the thumb against the index finger. We can attach the hands to the handle one of three ways. We can use a 10 finger grip, an overlapping grip, or an interlocking grip. How we attach our hands together isn't all that critical. The important part is that we get the club down in the fingers of both hands and our hands in a position where they can square the club face through impact. I'm Chris Foley for Chris Foley Golf Schools. Follow these tips and I guarantee your ball striking will improve.